In the billionaire's race to build a reusable rocket, Elon Musk might be edging ahead. The chief executive of SpaceX revealed on Twitter that the company, which has successfully landed four rockets, is planning to relaunch one of them in the next few months. If it goes ahead, this would make it the first relaunch of the private space company's rockets. This move would take the firm, and the aerospace industry as a whole, another step closer towards reusable rockets becoming commonplace. This could make deep space travel cheaper, helping pave the way for a viable manned mission to Mars. SpaceX is forging the way, with cargo contracts with NASA as well as with the U.S. military for satellite delivery. Elon Musk announced the Falcon 9 rocket which launched the TACOM-8 communications satellite is back in the hangar, with the three other first stages that have also made it safely back on the ground. Fourth rocket arrives in the hangar, he said. SpaceX has managed to land four rockets from space back on Earth, one on land and three on sea, with the latest successful sea landing on 28 May. Aiming for first reflight in Sept-October, Musk added. He also said the company is planning for its first relaunch of a Falcon 9 rocket in either September or October. Reusable rockets would cut costs and waste in the space industry, which currently loses millions of dollars in jettison machinery after each launch. The company plans to start offering a service to send payloads to Mars as early as 2018, with prices starting at 42 million for the Falcon 9 rocket. Rival company Jeff Bezos Blue Origin, successfully completed a third launch and vertical landing of its flagship rocket New Shepard in April this year. Bezos, the founder of Amazon.com and owner of the Washington Post newspaper, said last month Blue Origin expects to begin crewed test flights of the New Shepard next year and begin flying paying passengers as early as 2018. Russia Japan and the European Space Agency are also developing similar technology and are in testing stages.